Love that music. The NCAA tournament unofficially tipped off last night with the first four. They're like an, an asterisk on your bracket. But two local teams will have to wait to their turn, rather, to face off. CBS 3 Sports Director Don Bell joins us with more on the impending madness. DB. See, Alpha, I'm with you. It is the best track there is when that thing plays for NCAA tournament. All right, so listen, opportunities like these don't grow on trees. Delaware is going dancing for only the sixth time in school history. The Blue Hens will play Villanova on Friday. The bags are packed and the excitement was on full display as a team left for Pittsburgh. This is a special group. In the 39 year history of the CAA title game, they are the only fifth seed to win it. The Blue Hens will try to bring that same swag to them on the court in round one. These are memories that are going to last a lifetime for them. Um, you know, I wanted nothing more for them to be able to experience this. But we have a confident group, a group that really believes in each other. And as you know, anything can happen in a 40 minute game. I think if we go out there and play our best basketball, we have a chance to win. Uh, we were a five seed in the CAA tournament, so we were underdogs there, we were underdogs here. Uh, we treat every game the same. We're going to go out there and just uh, give it all we got, see what happens. You can watch the Blue Hens take on the Wildcats Friday afternoon right here on CBS3. Tip off is scheduled for 245. And be sure to join us at 7 tonight for our CBS3 Sports Zone special, Hoop Mania. Pat Gallen going to join us live from Pittsburgh. And 